God's War 2022. Hi, Saviors GH here. Today, we're gonna do a God's War gameplay from the beginning to show you guys what it's like playing the game from the start. God's War is a tab targeting chibi anime MMORPG. And with that said, let's do this. Let's go play the game, okay guys? Here's the character creation. First, let's name it. Then what's this? I think it's the starting city. We can start in Athens or Sparta. We're gonna start in Sparta! And then the next that we have here is the classes. We can be a champion, which is this. Then warrior, priest, and mage. We're gonna play as a mage. Then we can change our zodiac to Virgo. Then change our character to a female character. Okay, let's go. And now here's the character customization guys. We can change the hairstyle. There's only a few hairstyles, but it should be enough. Then we can also change the hair color and the face. That's about it in terms of character customization. Let's finish this. There goes our character, enter the game. And we're in the game. I set this game to 1080p, but for some reason, it kinda looks like 720p. So how about let's check out the systems. Oh, the, the display is blocked out. Info option? Nope. <laughs> so let's disable the music. Let's go. Okay, so we can move with point and clicking. Can we move with WSD? Nope. Oh, there goes our skill. <laughs> it's already put there. Okay. Let's talk to the newbie guide. New to Sparta. Accept. And what is that? Uh, what are we supposed to do there? Enter safe map. What? I mean, I want to adjust the display. Because the UI is kind of huge. Anyway, there's a quest over here. Let's take it. Oh, that's the quest. Weapon, we need to choose the staff. Oh, accept. Now we need to beat the leader. I think this is the leader. It's marked on the map as a pink question mark. Let's go over there. Man, the game is not optimized very well. It's not stable. But I can't deny that I'm used to these kinds of frame rates. Anyway, where's the NPC? It's supposed to be here. Let's open up our map. Oh, no. I thought the pink mark on the minimap was the quest destination. Nope. So, oh, what's that newbie gift bag? I think I need to open my bag. Okay, open my bag. Open the newbie gift bag. What is this? Shower skill. They give us potions. Use it. Open the bag again. Nope. Now, what are we supposed to do? Okay, so let's open up our quest log. Okay, there's autopathing, guys. It's asking me to press the autopathing. We're moving to the quest destination. Oh, there goes Stefanos. Turn over the quest, get the staff. Okay, we got staff. Now we have a new quest. And what we need to do, what is this? Okay, just claim it. <laughs> what? No, I can't claim it. Man, there's a lot of stuff on the screen. One by one, guys. I need to hunt down a silver tail scorpion. And we're moving to the destination. It's just outside, if I remember correctly. Yeah, there it goes. Can we rotate the camera? I think I could, but it's better that we shouldn't. Okay, close this. Let's hunt down 10 scorpions. Farble them up. Okay, we can three shot them. Can we add stats? We're kind of weak. Oh, I forgot. I can equip the new staff that I got. This one. Equip it. Hey, wait a minute. This one is 37 magic attack. It's the same thing. But this one has stats. This one doesn't have any stats. Okay, it's slightly better. Let's go. Hunt this silver tail scorpion. What's this skill again? Teleport shoot to Sparta. Let's move this. It's the portal scroll. Okay, let's hunt down. Man, can we tab? Oh yeah. We can press tab to target enemies. This is kind of annoying. Pointing to a monster because it wouldn't highlight. You can easily miss. And that's my only skill. I need to check out my skills. Talent. Basic focus, basic channeling. These are the passives, the talents. What I need is a new skill. Okay, anyway, let's finish up this quest. How many more do we need to hunt? Let's check it out. Four more. Ooh, what is that? Something's glimmering over there. Pick all. Ooh, is that a new staff? Short wand. Priest. Okay, it's for priest. Let's finish up the quest. Miss. Why am I missing a lot? Look at this. We need to finish the quest. Don't like the cooldown. We need another skill. 
One more scorpion and we're done. Okay, we're done. Let's turn it over. Village leader Stefanos. Transmit? What? Oh no, I accidentally pressed the transporter. Turn over the quest. Now mud crocodiles. Okay, let's open up our bag. We got a new armor. Man, why is it like that? It's kind of the same. Oh no, the armor is different. This one is green. Okay. What's this exclamation mark over here? Main quest reward. High quality equipment. What? What's that supposed to do? Let's open up this thing. Nope. Close it. Now let's go to the crocodile. And I need a new skill. I think this is the crocodile. Let's go. How many crocodile again? Let's hunt down one and see. Ah. Okay, so we need to hunt down 11 more. Man, this this thing keeps popping out. Why? Cross sword. Okay, let's press it. Oh, guys, there's autoplay in the game. Look at this. We can press this. But wait a minute. I think let's put some potions. Do I have any potions? Nope. I think this our EXP boost. Let's use it. We don't have any potions. No, I don't wanna enable autoplay. It's kinda boring. Let's do this the good old way. What? Is this one aggressive? Nope. Kinda wanna learn a new skill, Zodiac Pet. I can add. A talent point, right? This one increases mana. I want to increase magical damage. Yep. And magical accuracy. Nope. It's hit rating over here. Okay, let's add more. Max it out. Okay, that should be good enough, right? Let's hunt down the crocodiles. Five more. I remember the last time I played. I think I played as a spearman. And I, and I have a mega AOE. Three more. Did we level up? Yep. And we can't add any stats. We're hardly any different when we're level 1. <laughs> we just need to finish up this quest. Get new gears. One more. Oh, we're done with the quest. Open up the journal. Acacia. I think we should kill that one. Okay, let's turn over the quest. There goes the NPC. Let's turn it over. Finish. Find skill. What this be? Okay, let's find that skill merchant. There he goes. We can learn a new skill. Teach me a new skill. Skill merchant. So we buy skills in the game. Okay, finish this. Now she's asking us to hunt down snakes. But first, sell me some skills. Fireball 1. Star shower. What else can we learn here? Oh, okay. I can learn a star shower skill. Not enough silver. Oh my god, can we sell this? Sell it. 11 silver. Sell this one. Okay, I already have it. Man, I wasn't paying attention. It was in my inventory. <laughs> okay, I almost bought one. There it goes. We got another skill. Nice. Okay, let's do the next quest. Green snake. You guys know what? I didn't expect that there's so many people that want to play this game again. It's because a lot of people message me, like, there's a lot of people that message me about this game, that they want to play this again, and they couldn't play it because they couldn't download it. The problem there is, it's because Google Chrome is blocking the download. Yeah, it's probably detected as a virus. This is a very old game. They haven't, they barely updated this. So guys, if you want to play the game, use Firefox. Yeah, to download the game. And then after that, after you install it, run the game as administrator because it's not running as administrator from the start. Okay, anyway, there goes the green snakes. Let's hunt them down. Oh, we got a mega AOE. Problem here is we might not be able to hunt these guys down. Okay, let's see how it goes. Shower! I thought so. Let's kite them. I only hit a few of them. What? Let's go. Come here. Okay, we hunted down three. I only hit three enemies. Okay. Let's go. Oh, this, it helps at least. We have a super AOE skill.
Let's finish up the quest. Uh, <laughs> what? I was able to hit four. Okay, let's finish up the quest. Uh, okay, we're done with the quest. Let's turn it over. I remember they gave us mounts in this game and a pet. Okay, I guess I need to be level 10 before I get those. There goes the NPC. Give me a new quest. Okay, now what? Persian Kearney. I think that's the monster. It's a soldier. Let's go. I'm wondering, why is there some kind of a Athenian spy over here? Can we fight this? What's your level? Ooh, 121. <laughs> I almost clicked him. <laughs> okay, let's go. Ignore them. What's this? Check. Claim. Okay, we claimed something from this box. What's that? We need to be level 10 to be able to equip it. But my current equipment is better. Can we sell it? Silver 14. And there goes our target. Hunt them down. Super AOE them. Let's go. Okay. This is gonna take a while. 15 enemies. The cooldown is taking too long. I miss a lot. That's the main problem. Okay, so how about... Let's open up our skills again. Maybe add some passives to make our attack stronger. Skills. Can we increase the level of our skills? Nope. It's just the passives. Okay. What's this? Dodge rating, HP restoration. I don't want that. I want more attack. <laughs> Magical damage. Man, I can't increase it. Why? So how about let's add more of this. Oh, okay. So as I add more basic focus, I'm allowed to add more basic channeling. Let's go. Let's focus on the magical damage. Okay, we don't have any more talent points. Close this. Let's see if we improved. Mm, nope. I thought my super AOE is gonna one-shot these monsters. Let's finish up the quest. Oh, level 10. Let's open up our new big gift box. There it goes. What do you have for me? Thunder. There it goes. We got a new skill, guys. Thunder. Is it super AOE too? <laughs> What's this? Ruby. It can increase gear level. Clicking it, but nothing's happening. Special pet shed. What? Okay. There goes the pet shed. I used it and I don't know where it goes. <laughs> okay, anyway. We got a new skill. Let's try it out. I need the target to be able to use it. Oh, nice. It's very strong. I can one-shot enemies with that. Okay, let's finish up the quest. And we're done with the quest. Let's start it over. Okay, guys. Before we turn over the quest, we're gonna check out the cash shop. And here it is, guys. It's a giant icon on the UI. Ball. And before we check out these items, prices first. The cash up currency here is called gold. It's just gold. And 2000 gold is 5.5 USD. Yes. And of course, the more you buy, the more gold you get. You will get more bonuses. Okay, now let's check out the gems tab. And here we got the bronze wear. And this is the enhancement item, guys. This is the thing that upgrades your equipment. Then we got a holy box over here. First, before I explain this, I would like to say that the translations, the descriptions, is really bad. Man, it's a bit difficult to understand. And based on my understanding here, this holy box is an item that gathers EXP. And you can use that item to level up your equipments. So yeah, there's a lot of those kinds of holy box over here. And we got some heated holy stone over here that adds attack abilities to your equipments. There's a lot of them over here. And then these crystals, look at this. This level one crystal, this is the item that increases the success rate of forging gear. Now, what else do we have here? Most of these are crystals. It adds a different amount of percentage. So yeah, the more you pay, the higher the success rate. <laughs> so yeah, that's about it. So let's move on to the goods tab. According to this, yeah, these are, I think these are gems. They are put in the wrong tab. Well, anyway, you can put these gems in your equipment and you can add abilities to your equipment. Like for example, this fire spirit of destruction. If you put this in your equipment, you can ignore enemy's physical defense. The god ignores enemy magical defense, reduce critical defense, increase critical attack. You guys get the point there, right? And they're also selling potions. Look at this. Super healing potion. They got 
a different amount of magic healing potion over here that can heal 7,000 HP. And of course, mana potions, they have it here too. And look at here, there's a staple over here, the medium EXP potion. EXP boost, guys. For one hour, you get 100% more EXP. And then this parcel stone over here, this is the inventory expansion. I don't know why they called it parcel stone. Okay, so now let's move on to the next tab, the scroll tab. And what is this? This is a package. Move it. Yeah, holy stone package. It gives you a lot of stuff and according to it, it's worth 6,100 gold. <laughs> let's ignore that. Oh, okay. You guys wanted to see this? Experience, guys. You can buy experience in the game. All of these scrolls over here, if you use it, you get EXP. So you can skip the grind. And these items over here, these two items over here, is a gacha box for pet skins. Man, they didn't label it correctly. We're still in the scroll tab. Here's the pet tab. Well, anyway, because look at this. They're selling pets here too. Look at this. Here's the tiger baby, the panda pet, the Easter bunny pet, and ghost pet. And all of these items over here are EXP boost for your pet. They're also buffs. And then here's your regular portal scroll. They're also selling it in the cash shop. And other teleportation scrolls for different places in the game. Now let's move on to the pet tab. Okay, you can buy a lot of pets over here. Pet gears, pet foods, you name it. Now let's move on to the stuff. <laughs> they labeled it the stuff tab. And what do we get here? We get stuff. <laughs> According to this, this copper evasion signet increases the success rate of transforming level 4 holy stones into level 5 holy stones. Those holy stones, guys, if I understand it correctly, it's the thing that we put in our equipment so we can add special abilities to our gears. So yeah, you can level those up. And if you want to increase the success rate of increasing the level of those holy stones, you gotta buy this. There's a lot of it. Now let's move on to the costumes. Look at this. We can buy a lot of costumes in the game. We got some maid costumes over here, some fireworks, advance, and super fireworks, a torero suit, if you want those, a tank suit, and a chong sam. Okay, so we can dress up in the game. There's a lot of costumes here and I don't think we need to check them all out. Now let's move on to the book tab. Okay, let me simplify this to you guys. These are skills. You can buy skills in the cash shop. Okay, let's take a look at the first book. Look at this. Here's the book of light chop 3. If you use this, you learn greater light chop skill. And there's a lot of skills in here that you can buy in the cash shop. I hope you saw what you needed to see because... There's no more tabs. Let's go back, play the game. Okay, what are we supposed to do again? Turn over the quest. Done. Finish. Accept. Now what? We need to go to the warehouse. Okay, we're heading to the warehouse. There goes the warehouse. Turn over the skill. Turn over the quest. Now I need to hunt down flowers. Okay, let's autopath. I don't know where those flowers is. Man, there's a lot of Filipinos playing this. Look at this. <laughs> this guy is saying that he rather watch Netflix than play end game content. <laughs> okay, here's the flower sprite. Let's hunt them down. Lightning. Oh my. Then super AoE. Oh, what happened? No, I'm not trying to loot. Okay. Shoot them down. We need more hit rate. I'm missing. We need to hunt down 15 of these things. Whoa, my HP. Okay, we got them all. Can we sit down in this game? Insert? Nope. I don't know if we can sit down or not. Let's open up our bag. What do we have here? Here's a basic healing potion. Use it. Let's put it at F1. Okay, let's use the lightning skill. Then the super AOE skill. Let's go. What? It's missing. I guess we really need to put a lot of hit, right? Okay, how many more do we need to kill? Five more. Let's go. Lightning skill. An AoE. Oh, we leveled up. I forgot. We should have put hit rate. Because we're messing. Open up our talents. Where's my talents? Okay, there it goes. Add more hit rate. Oh, that's crit. No, we don't need crit. Close this. And then let's finish the quest. Let's go. Lightning skill. 
And we're done with the quest. Let's turn it over. Look at those crocodiles. Imagine going out of your house and there's a lot of freaking crocodiles. <laughs> okay. There goes the NPC. Turn it over. Confirm. Now we need to hunt down sirens. It's probably mermaids. I'm just guessing. Let's go. Most of the questing in this game is just like this. They make you hunt 15 of this monster, 15 of that monster. Rinse and repeat. Okay guys. This is how you download the game. Use Firefox because Chrome blocks the download of God's War. And always run the game as administrator for it to run. And that should be good enough. Let's go hunt down some more quest targets. Oh no. It's like the flower enemy. Okay, let's go. Hunt them down. Again, 15. Hey, yo, eat him up. I really feel like my skills are not enough. Lightning skill? What? You survived it? Super AOE. Whoa. Go away a bit. Big old. I haven't been looting. Because, because I don't really know if I can loot or not. That's 10 sirens. Need to hunt down five more. What? I missed the lightning attack. Super AOE. One last siren. Boom. Man, they're surviving my last attack. And that's God's War from the start. It's as standard as it goes when it comes to MMORPGs. The questing is grindy. There's hardly anything else but talk to NPC and hunt down exactly 15 monsters. Now, the combat is not responsive. And specifically targeting a monster, like clicking on them, seems to not work very well. Because I miss highlighting an enemy 7 times out of 10. It's kind of annoying, I must say. Now, the graphics is colorful and vibrant, but it's running on 720p, even though I set it to 1080p. It has this problem for a long time now, and I don't think they will ever fix it. As for the game's performance, there are stutters, especially when you're going to a new area and opening menus. All in all, God's War is an okay game. And if you want to check the game out, the details are on the screen. And if you like the video, hit the thumbs up, share, and then subscribe to be part of the Gamey Hardcore family. And as always, this is Gamey Hardcore. See you in the next one.